Black woman killed by a sheriff. Let's get into it. Well, Scott and Sylvia, this story is making national headlines going beyond this state. This shooting is leading to several protests in southern Illinois. Court documents released today detail the incidents that happened on July 6th, saying that the deputy shot 36-year-old Sonia Massey, who you see here in her face during a tense moment, over a pot of water in her home. The deputy has been identified as Sean Grayson. Prosecutors say after he shot Massey, he discouraged another deputy from getting a medical kit from their vehicle. In a statement released this week, the Sangamon County State's Attorney says a review of body camera video doesn't support the use of deadly force. Governor J.P. Pritzker says he is grateful that charges have now been filed. We've seen too much of this where an innocent person, unarmed, uh, who actually called for assistance, uh, was the, the target and the victim of a shooting by a police officer. And this is not, it does not reflect on all police officers. This particular sheriff's deputy um, committed a crime. Massey. The information on this case is not making sense to me. So this lady called 911 to get assistance. 911 showed up and because she had a pot on the stove that was boiling, he told her to turn it off. She didn't want to turn it off, so he shot her in the face or something. What, did he get triggered by the hot water being on the stove, so he decided to shoot her? And why did he tell his partner not to get any assistance for, for the lady after shooting her? This case is not making any sense. It's almost like these two individuals know each other or had a history with each other. My condolences to the family. Let me know what you guys think.